Okay, so that's a Shedinja. Um, I actually have a pretty decent matchup here. I think I always just lead off this way. Like, they have almost nothing for that. Uh, the only thing that could be kind of annoying is an Incineroar lead, which, not the end of the world, to be honest. I think uh, Grimmsnarl is going to be super good in this matchup and definitely want to bring Zacian. in. Maybe you should build around Zurn sometime. I'm not a big fan of Zurn. I'm shocked you built the team so fast. I had every Pokemon but two. It was just the Buzzwool and... Um, what was the other one? And the Regia, like, yeah, I had to change. Those are the only two Pokemon I needed. It's support Thunderous? Okay. So unless this is like Scarf Kartana, I'm actually in a pretty good spot. Let's just go for the KO. This is the stronger one, right? Yeah, Wild Charge. Let's go for the KO on you. And I'll go for a Will-O-Wisp on this cart. Let me go full screen. Alright, who's Dynamaxing? Looks like it's probably going to be the Kartana, which if I get this off, I'm pretty happy with the outcome of this. Yep. The only way this doesn't go how I want it to is if, um, is if I get, like, what's it called? Thunder Waved on my Calyrex. Alright, that's fine. We weren't really planning on doing much damage to that anyways. Listen, Incineroar 2, if you Eerie Impulse Incineroar 2, it's about as useful as Eerie Impulsing Incineroar 1. I'm just going to put that out there for you for you non-believers. Alright, please connect to the Will-O-Wisp or I will cry. No way we missed the Will-O-Wisp after the High Horsepower crit. Let's go! Hopefully it's not Lum. It's probably AV though. Yeah. Max Knuckle? Pathetic. <laughs> Wait, why did that do so little? Why did that actually do so little? You're a Kartana, man. Come on. Get your head in game. Alright, I, I have the strangest of feelings. We can just double. I have the strangest of feelings. We can ignore the Kartana for the rest of the match. Kind of. I might even substitute, but it's not worth it. Let's just let's just Astro Brush, because you burned it. I know I know we burned it, but it's still a Kartana, and I'm still a Regieleki. Go ahead and protect, Stinky. Ah oh, crap, maybe I should have airstreamed. I think I should have airstreamed. <laughs> Some EV cards only have four attack. Actually, most of them do. Most of them only have four attack, yeah. Well, I did nothing. Um, did I bring the Incineroar? I already forgot. That's going to inform my next turn pretty heavily. I did not. Let's just go for it. Um, I'm going to double the Zacian, which might seem a little short-sighted, but believe me, it's probably going to be worth it. Is it? Is it, though? Is it, though? Maybe I just Airstream. No, nah, no, nah, I, I go for the KO. I go for the KO. But I also attempt to burn, because if it doesn't work out, that's still a decent, like, backup. Beamoth Blade. Looks like it's going into my um, Calyrex. 
which is fine. Because I shouldn't drop to Kartana, and this will KO. Nice! Absolutely busted. Busted Pokemon. We need to ban it. There's the Knuckle. That still did a chunk. Um, in this situation, I have a bit of a controversial take. Uh, if I, I have to fake out in case it's Scarf, so I'm going to go right into my Grimmsnarl and attempt to KO the Kyogre. If it doesn't work, I still have Screens plus Zacian in the back, so I probably win. Buzzwool on the physical side is pretty, uh, pretty uh, bulky in practice. Big Cat, that like that's that's just like crazy how many hits it can take. The other day we like got Behemoth bladed by a Zacian that we intimidated once and it basically bounced off. <clears throat> There's no way that's Scarf Kartana, right? I, you know, we don't even have to fake out the Kyogre. If it's Scarf, our, our Regieleki should be faster. So we just attack and fake out the Kartana. I was going to fake out the Kyogre at first, and then I'm like, ah, it's not worth it. There's truly no reason. Kyogre drops to this. And if it does protect, we just repeat the same turn, but go for a Reflect the next turn. Base Calyrex can take a Fire Punch from from Dawn in the Sun. I mean, I believe it. I believe it. Alright, they do protect. Uh, we just Reflect and go for another one. Alright. Go for this wild charge and a reflect, and we should be good. <clears throat> All right, this should do it. No way you live this. Dude, physical Aleki is something I haven't really used much before, but the damage output's a little bit ridiculous. The better move pull is also huge. Okay. <clears throat> Let's just go for an Electro Web and we'll get the Zacian in here. I don't want to give him any boost. Or actually, is there really a reason to. Nah. There's not, real re there's not really a reason. Actually, there is a reason to go hard into Zacian, because he could actually win here <laughs> if I don't. Question, in Gen 9, should Water Sweat moves have 10% recoil so it's not as free? Not really. I think, I think it's a perfectly balanced move. The move only has 8 PP total, and at, at that, if you Sucker Punch them, their damage is cut significantly. If you fake out them, their damage is cut significantly. You have to do a decent amount of like preparation and prediction to make sure your water spout goes off correctly in like a in like a mid-level match and higher. Zacian, a Pokemon whom everyone complains is too OP, had only one more cut in the most recent tourney than Alchemy. Curious. <laughs> That's actually really funny. Alright. Oh, he leaf bladed. That's a crit. Alright, I got fake out, I got sacred sword, we're good. Nice. Nice little game there. Oh, 
Also, just so you guys know, the stream's gonna end at 7 today, because I actually have plans with some friends tonight. So, genuine question, between Buzzwool and and Grapplocked, which one do I bring to Milwaukee Regionals? Genuine question there. Let me know. Matic. This is quite the problematic team for me. Uh, I think I want to go with the... Do I lead off a Leki? It, it's kind of a risk. Kind of a risk. I think I go. All right, I'm gonna go Aleki Grimmsnarl. I'm gonna bring the Calyrex in the back, and this is still not a Buzzwool game. This is still not a Buzzwool game. Uh, is it? I think it's a Zashian game. Eh, no, let's let's bring Buzzwool. Let's let's just bring Buzzwool. All right. Cowgirl Whims got okay, this is quite literally the perfect week for me. We have a little bit of a of an issue though. Do I max lightning the Kyogre? I'm gonna do it. I'm I'm gonna say they didn't bring the Rolecki answer. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna say that. I'm just gonna say it. Do I have any proof? No. They didn't. Cool. Awesome. Epic. Gaming. You're gone. You're gone. He on X Games mode. <laughs> Alright, there's the Zacian. Um... This should always KO if I just get a Reflect off. Yeah, no, there's definitely no Marowak in the back. Are you guys also experiencing frame drops? I, I, I'm, I just want to check because I'm on my home internet for the first time in a couple of, you know, months. Uh, and we have much worse internet here than at my campus. Looks like there'd be humans playing in this thing. Alright, I think we won. There's no way Zashin takes this hit. This is like one of the strongest electric moves possible. Yep. Puzzle's one of the most base Pokemon. Even when he dies, he's flexing. True. Let's bring him in here. Everyone, everyone give a round of applause for Buzzwool. Come on, Buzzwool, get in here, bud. Oh, it's Charizard. Yeah, I think we win. Dude, if he targets my Char- If, if he targets my Buzzwool, I'm gonna be real upset with him. If in this situation, this man's dying wish is to target my Buzzwool, I'm gonna be real upset. Let's dual wing beat. If you max guards, we take the Whimsicott, and then we just win anyways. Listen, we, re we resist every move he hits. Or, we resist every stab move Charizard has. We have Rain Up. 
and we res yeah, we're, I think I mean, we're Dynamax. I think we're good. The only thing I'm mildly concerned about is like a life orb scorching sands in the max quake. Okay, he max guarded, so I think we win. Dude's got hurricane. Sir. Sir. Why do you have hurricane? This might still be winnable. This this might still be winnable. I have to double target the Charizard. I, I still think I live anything the Charizard wants to go for. Because we do have some bulk. He's got a hurricane. Alright, please tell me you just decided to ignore the Regieleki. Okay, he did. I think we're fine. I think that's a win. Unless he has, like, Wakanberry. Okay, yeah, we win. <laughs> That was a close call, guys. That I cannot lie. That was a close call. That was a close call. Nice. Yeah, listen, they have to carry Hurricane... Uh, Life Orb Hurricane to deal with the new Buzzwool meta that's been rising up for the past 24 hours. Like that that's why he had it. He had to deal with the Buzzwool meta that's been right. developing. Um oh yo, it's the it's the Drampa I've been hearing so much about. It's the Drampa. Am I crazy to say that I want to go Grim Snarl Buzzwool lead on this guy and just go crazy on him? Is that is that a crazy thing to say? I don't think it is. I don't think it is. We bring the Calyrex in the back, and we bring the Zacian, and we just we just live. We're living. My opponents existing. Me living. Listen, last time we were playing this game, the adjustment we had to make to do better was use Buzzwell more. Grimmsnarl Calyrex? I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. You listen here, buddy. I'm gonna hit you. <laughs> uh, is that my play? I think I just airstream him, to be honest. I'm pretty sure I airstream the Calyrex, and I go for a light screen, and if they don't go for a psychic move, we just win. How much special defense does our Buzzwell have again? 84 with an Assault Vest. Yeah, we're good. Okay, okay, I see, I see. Astro Barrage, pathetic. He's, he really is handing out knuckle sandwiches today. Oh, would you look at that? That's a two-shot, buddy. That's a two-shot. That's crazy. That's crazy. I'm crazy. I'm going to airstream again. I'm going to get my light screen off. Um, yeah, he can get a reflect off, but even then, I, I'm, I'm outspeeding him next turn. Buzzwell's Knuckles from Sonic 2. True. Scary face? Okay. Uh, rude, but we're still in a decent spot. That, that was kind of rude. Can't lie, that was, that was kind of rude. But now we're at plus one. 
Now we're at plus one attack. And uh, their answers for our for our um, Calyrex are reduced. Good little beast boost there. Look how Buzzwall's nose just like, or his his like sucker is just like drooping out towards us. Like that's just funny. Um. I'm going to keep it real with you guys. I don't think we live this. I think what I want to do here is I'm going to hand over my buzz wall. Unfortunately, that is the way this is going to go. I'm going to hand over my buzz wall and I'm going to get a reflect off. And then we're going to get in the Calyrex. And if they don't have a dark move, we're fine. Fairly certain we don't take this hit. Watch them just fumble the bag so hard and not attack Puzzle. There's the Reflect. Next turn we're going to get the Calyrex in. We're just going to go for a Will-O-Wisp. As he scary faces me again, meaning he probably just doubled down. Airstream, that's fine. We're going to go for the Will-O-Wisp next turn. We should live whatever as long as they don't have a dark move. If they do have a dark move, that's just unfortunate. <laughs> it's kind of hard to fit a dark move on this thing. You want to run ground, flying, and fighting. Unless they're AV, they don't have a dark move. Wisp you. Let's get the Zashi in. And I imagine this thing's Sash, judging by the fact that it hasn't taken, like, Life Orb or anything. Yeah, Buzz will still flexed on him. Tried to Sucker Punch. That's good. He air streamed? Okay. Absolute poggers. Absolutely poggers. He thought that was going to work. It did not. It did not, unfortunately, for my opponent. You've just been burned, sir. You have been burned. Now give me your lunch money. Now, I'm going to get my Calyrex out, bring back in the Grim Snarl, and annihilate theirs. Uh, they also revealed they don't have any screens or anything, because I believe they've just gone for Fake Out, Sucker Punch, and Scary Face. So they're non-screens. Aha! You fool! Knuckle, pathetic. <laughs> Wait, that actually did just bounce off. That actually did just bounce off of us, that's really funny. Go for the B-Blade. Pretty sure we just win now. Um, they had a Zacian in the back, right? It was Calyrex Zacian. If that's the case, we just fake out the cat or we fake out the Zacian this turn, and we go for a Behemoth Blade in the Zapdos, pick up that KO, and then we win with our Calyrex, since it's Fizz Def. Yep, there's Zacian. Let's go for the fake out, and we'll B-Blade, and all will be good in the world. Unless, of course, they have Protect. Then things get a little bit more complicated, but we'll deal with that when we get there. Here lies Big Bird. He could not handle Incineroar 2. There's no way he lives this, right? Oh, he's got coaching. See, that's an issue. See, that's a legitimate issue.
All right, that does KO. Uh, this turn's a little bit rough. Uh, one would assume they're just going to go ahead and try to KO my Zacian. So I actually do something kind of interesting. I get my Calyrex in. And I Behemoth Blade. They should be going for my Zacian. I'd imagine you just ignore the Grim Snarl here. No, they do not. That's a little annoying, uh, but we're still fine. Just double down on them next turn we win. Just want to point out, that's plus two Zacian. And a Reflect caused, them, caused their damage to drop by that much. That's plus two Zacian. That's coaching Zacian, dude. No need to will us We'll just Astral Barrage. They're like, how do you live? <laughs> I could have substituted there. That'd be such a flex. Uh, but there's honestly no reason to. All right. Let's hit him with the Nene once more. Can I get some Nene's in chat? It's been a minute since we had Nene's in chat. Someone hit me with a Nene in the chat. Calyrex? Let's go! <laughs> okay, this is actually a really, really good Buzzwool game. Like, absurdly good. Like, it's almost like I knew this team would be good someday, just so I could bring Buzzwool. Like, I'm magic like that. I'm, I'm just magic like that. I'm so magical. Truly, what did they do versus Buzzwool? <laughs> All right. Oh no, Gothitel. You see, Gothitel, I regret to inform you that it is not you who is stuck in here, or that it is not I who is stuck in here with you, it is you who is stuck in here with me. I think I just snarl in Max Bug and they have like no options for that. Is this stream sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends? Do you want it to be? Dude, I don't know what you do in this in this situation. I don't I don't know what they do in this situation. I'm gonna snarl the Palkia regardless of what happens, and if Trick Room goes up, they still don't like that. Gothitelle can try to go out and do Incinerar, but I don't know how much it's gonna help. They withdraw the Palkia, okay. Okay, cope. Cope. Check this out, I'm gonna go back up to neutral. Immediately. Can't fake out me, I'm Buzzwool, dude. Flex on them, okay. Front double bicep. They don't have protect. This thing's this thing's gone. It's gone. There's no way they have like a bug item. There's no way they have the bug berry.
Oh, he's faster. What? How are you? F how much speed is it? That's a max speed Gothitel. That's a max speed Gothitel, right? They have to be like timid. That's got to be like timid, right? Because my buzz was at 117 speed. What's Gothitel's max? That could have been so bad. Timid? Level 50? Let me see. Yup. Yup, they get pretty fast. That's almost max speed Gothitelle. That's crazy. Also, I win. Keep forgetting Unnerve turns off berries. That's just a myth perpetuated by Big Unnerve. Let's max Knuckle the Incineroar and go for a Snarl. Incineroar might live this, but it's kind of like whatever if it does. What's your spread on the Buzzwall? On the Buzzwall, thank you for the follow, whoever just followed uh, Apple Fritter. Oh, I just faced you. Um, the Buzzwall is 4 HP, 28 defense, and 80... Don't you miss the Palkia. Oh, no. And 84 special defense with an assault vest. Okay, that's not ideal. Hopefully we can KO this Incineroar. Yep. We are now at plus one attack, or plus two, because Max Knuckle gave us plus one initially. Dang, that snarl would have been so good there. Oh, it's Alchemy! Oh, this is bad. Wait, this is really bad. This is actually really, really bad. Uh, no, no, it's not that bad. Uh, let's Max Quake the Alchemy and just get rid of it. And I'm going to attempt another Snarl, and then I just win because I have Grim Snarl on the back. Can you take any flying attacks? Physically, yeah. Not specially. Maybe I'm slower than this thing. Maybe they are running some speed, but I really doubt it. Because they're just going to decorate. Okay, big pog, big pog. Dazzling Gleam, that's not going to do much. Going to go for the big quake. This should KO every time. Alchemy's physical defense leaves a lot to be desired. It is living that. Oh no, but I did snarl, so that might do it. Don't you dare miss the Alchemy here. I will cry. And that's a that's another that's another special attack boost. There we go. All right, uh, I think that we can eat a hit. I think we can eat a hit with our Buzzwall. I want to see how much our Leech Life's about to do. Let's see how much our Leech Life does. Actually, no, let's close combat. I want to close combat because it'll be definitely funnier. Ah, they forfeit. That's fine. Big Buzzwool game, though. That was a huge game for Buzzwool. Absolutely huge. But yeah, uh, I know it was a little bit of a shorter stream. We're going to be closing it off here. Uh, but stick around. We're going to raid one of our opponents from earlier who was streaming. If you enjoyed, you know, if you're watching on YouTube, leave a like, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.